oh, I go to the club. Oh, what were you wearing? Ah, uh, asking for it. Well, no, nobody asked to be raped. When we think about empowering women, you need to give women this. Really no, it's, it's not, not that. that right? It's it's the shift of the narrative. I really believe it's the shift of the narrative. So with men, it's like, oh, what? So men can't do this? It's like, no, men can do whatever you want, but you also you also have to look at how the women are seen in that light. I mean, only recently we talk about sex, sexual abuse victims. We call them survivors now. Right. Right, right, okay, okay. You know, like that's a change, that's yeah. a shift in the narrative. Yeah. Even it's like, oh, I go to the club, oh, what were you wearing? Uh, asking for it. Well, no, nobody asked to be raped, yeah. even if you wear a short skirt. Like, yeah, yeah. you know, what's the reason of why people get raped? Because a rapist, right? Yeah. And so, um, when, in, in regards to men, it's saying, you know, let's not tell our daughters to be a certain way, let's tell boys to be also open to the fact that there's a lot of people that are out there that are, you know, we're in the same place. So it's, I feel like with men, it's just being open to the fact that women have the same rights. That's the feminist agenda is actually, we just want equal rights. We actually, no one thinks we're better. No one thinks we're better or worse that we need to live without one or the other. It's not that at all. So when I empower women, I empower women to empower themselves, to empower their communities, to empower, empower their families, their workplaces, and I'm sure there's some men in those places, and therefore they end up benefiting from this. Hey guys, thanks for watching. Glad you liked it. Now, if you want to check out a full discussion on all our other episodes, click right here. And of course, don't forget to subscribe.